this season, but same anime because we got back to back, no split core. Skimichi, apparently there's the opening and there's like kind of spoiling the visuals. So I'm going to be like this while watching it. Let's begin the second half of season two. Hit us up with that high cue, bro. Are you serious? We're gonna get a fucking culture festival arc in this show too? Like, you know, in every fucking high school slice of life, there's a culture festival, there's a summer festival, there's a, you know, all these different fucking events. Where's the sports festival, bro? Where's the sports festival arc? Competitive tournament? Tournament arc, tournament arc, tournament arc! Limia and other place. So, so this is basically Harry Potter arc four, the fucking goblet arc, the goblets whatever fucking thing. You know, it's it's like other schools are showing up, and it's like inter school high school fucking tournament arc, like in fucking Mahoka, dude. Okay, okay. And our students are so much better now compared to every one of them, right? You jinxed that something bad's gonna happen. I feel like the opening too is about to play. Is it? Wakasama. Oh, it's loud. What kind of research you do, bro? Important people from other kingdoms? Temple priest. Okay. Yeah, sure, it's a chronic condition, sure. <laughs> what, there's a, you think there's a fucking cat? You know, it's basically the same as like, you know, oh, in like Green Crisis Slime, the potions are too high grade. How are you just giving out this so easily? So, okay, what are you doing here? Hmm. And you know what? Other than the potions, I think we should fucking figure out how to make those rings that like, you know, um, prevent human blessings from the goddess, right? You remember the demons, they fucking crack it and it's like, and then everyone gets debuffed. But like, if we sold that at regular stores, wouldn't the humans actually get really upset? So maybe like we should set up like a shop in like the demon lord, like a, like a demon territory. Can we like open up like a, our our separate branch there and just sell them rings there? Maybe just a good person just wants to know what the potion. Is he actually bribing? Huh? Whoa, 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 whoa. What did he say? Do you want the temples to like sell for us? A middleman. But well, they got a fucking percentage of the cuts though. But are we basically jacking up our prices and basically the temple's gonna have more people to sell to? So we make more money, but the average consumer gets fucked by paying overpriced prices and then the temple also gets a cut on top of that? <laughs> then, then forget I said anything. <laughs> Well, they probably won't leak the information because they want like a monopoly over the potion, you know, production, right? But can we trust them? Temples kind of sounds like the church and we never, you know, fucking trust the church from, you know, an isekai show. I know it's a different thing, but I'm not sure if he's a good guy or not. Pretty much, yeah. Temple could make knockoff brands? Are you threatening us, bro? Oh, the human experiments that we were doing research on. That's what Rona was even involved to. Again, the fucking temple, the church, synonymous. They're bad people. No, fuck them, fuck them. Rona killed a previous bitch. <laughs> Ah, we're just, we're just a merchant. Okay. Basically, keep your enemies close, right? Interesting. Tax evasion, bro. The church never has to pay taxes because it's religious, bro. That's why they can fucking afford, you know, gigantic stuff like this. Oh my god. Right! Because it's like a temple. Who are you worshipping? The goddess, so they're like, these are like truly our most fundamental natural fucking enemies, aren't they? I mean, she looks pretty fucking nice though. Mm. For some reason, they never show us her eyes. 
Oh. What is this? The fucking Reverend Mother? They have such power in just public perception, like these rumors they can just get rid of, implying that they can also, you know, stoke the same rumors and make people's reputations bad. So interesting that how much network and powers they have. Yes, blame the goddess. No, we're good. Don't solve it. We're good. Your holiness. Yeah, she's gotta be so hot underneath that veil. What does she look like? Bye. Oh, do we for looking up while everyone else is looking down? Is is that what that was? I think so. I think it was the manners. クズの派殿にはいくつか話をさせてもらいたい。え? The temple even knows More Rembrandt clout? He's called against the temples. Yo, fuck the goddess. Good. Fucking cut ties with them. Giga Chad Rembrandt. Let's go. Kind of? Not really? It's coincidence, right? Hmm. I can't tell the words. I don't know. They seem like okay, right? It doesn't seem overly evil. So far, people here seems okay, but I'm sure the inner workings within the temples, you know, doing all the fucking planning around humanoid experimentations and sketchy shit like that. That must be the really evil parts, right? So far, they look. They fuck. I don't know. The person we're talking to, the fucking mother with the fucking veil. They, they, they. I, I don't know why I call her mother. They, they, they look okay. Maybe I spoke too soon. Maybe I spoke too soon. Wait. We're getting spied? What? She can tell? Our examinations of his mild and mana failed because he's too strong. He's too OP. They could not, like, appraise him? What? Blocked. Blocked. Subconsciously or consciously? <laughs> is it the Kai? What is it? I mean, just because we give you like the secret ingredient doesn't mean you can just copy it. So 100%, you know, purity, they can only emulate 50%. And on top of that, they can never even tell the fucking, you know, the mana or the mind. So the, the, and the spy, if there's someone actually spying us right now, aren't they just going to get killed? It's not worth it. Mm, you can't do what we do. You don't got the tech. We're just the merchant. What do you mean? Scar. Important scar on her eye that reaches to her lips, but okay. Very interesting design. I, I, I like her so far. I don't know. I don't know what she's about. She's probably going to be fucking evil, but like, hmm. It's also possible he'll become our trump card in the future. So like, within the temple, I don't know which side she's on, but like, imagine she's somehow anti-goddess and she's trying to find the appropriate person to, you know, revolt against the goddess. Maybe there's like two separate factions within the fucking temple, the church, right? The pro-goddess or the anti-goddess. Wasn't there kind of talks in the beginning before, uh, in this season, about like, not all humans really worship the goddess, right? Specifically, was it Bright? Yeah, Bright was like, nah, fuck the goddess, right? And Bright was the one that was in it with the human experimentations? Are we cooking somewhere? Is she part of the anti? Don't spoil me, but it, it could be. I don't know if she's saying our trump card is a champion against the goddess, or maybe she thinks that we can be used as a pawn for something else. <laughs> Banana. <laughs> yeah, she could. <laughs> she's built <laughs> different, bro. Banana. <laughs> Incantations of the old language, she's just gonna say Banana. 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 I actually like Eris a lot. Eris is very funny to me. Banana milk? Oh my god, they're gonna fucking lose it, dude. New banana product. New crack for them, bro. We're just fucking developing more fucking banana extracts, bro. 
<laughs> Banana milk is pretty good. <laughs> the key is to choose magic words from the old language that suits you. Is she actually gonna make him stronger? Missed A! Shit, 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 shit. You're leaking. You're leaking. No more bananas for you for the next two months. She sold out her friend so quick. Come on, give, give her some banana milk too. She's so cute. Oh, he was hiding. He was hiding. Is this cheating? Oh, well, cheating as in like, you know, you know, Wakasama is my master, right? Makoto is a teacher, but if you're asking Eris, you know, for different, you know, apprentice stuff, then technically you're cheating on your master with another master, right? So I guess maybe that's what's implied. I feel like it's fine to get some help from Eris. Why not? Spy. Our spy from the temple? Temple spies? We should get our, our spy to kill him. Or Makoto can do him himself. Where's Lemon at? Wait. They're the same. You know, the assassins. Yeah. We got a new mode. Sorry. Yo, our slime Susano is getting even like cooler. Is he the same person? Yeah, he is. <laughs> Do you complete every job? <laughs> Greater Dragon Mitsurugi. Hold up! You know, Mitsurugi is the other word for Lancer, right? Sophia Boga and you got Mitsurugi who is actually Lancer. He made... What the fuck? Why the fuck would he have this? The Assassin Guild? But they're also sent by the temple. The temple... Sophia, Bulga, Mitsurugi, how do they all fucking, you know, con how, how do they- Maybe he just fucking had an Agasa mat, who knows? <laughs> we can't mix shit, dude. You can't cut us? You know what? I- yeah, his scales are wasted on that blade, but like this, you know, the slime form, the mana matter, it's actually looking pretty cool. Before, it was looking kind of goofy, right? But now it actually seems to have an actual form. Kind of looks like a fucking devil, you know? Look at those horns. <laughs> Maybe the same drugs that, you know, Bright was giving out. Makoto doesn't have to do anything anymore. The mana matter just hits for us. Kill him all. What the fuck did he just do? Dude, that kind of fucking... It looks like the goddess is fucking summoning us. It looks like he killed us all, right? I mean, the, the beam, I'm gonna assume that they're all, all dead. Or is it Mistgate? I don't know. Are we torturing them? Interrogation? CGI. Oh, he's mad. He's mad mad. Look at that. You got that killing look in his eye. All right. The climate has been changing. Makoto is causing global warming. Mm. Different location you open, then the weather was stabilized. Is it the wind? Now we have a reason to go to a demon place and open a gate and kind of have our own territory there. Clean up. Can't we like work with Rona or some shit to open a gate? And if we have that gate open, it's like a permanent open gate. We need have to have people protecting it or else like demons could just fucking enter the gate and enter the plane, right? Isn't that a problem? That, that's some future stuff, some plot stuff set up. CGI! Oh. Tomoe and Mio are joining? Sensei, wake up. Are the kids outside telling him to get up? I think they are. <laughs> Banana. 
<laughs> Lime is also working outside. We're killing it. Capitalism. Money. Other people are also talking about our shop. Getting more promo. Yeah, you'd never disturb him. Mm. They just watch him sleep. That's what they do. <laughs> Tomoe really likes drinking, huh? Oh? Church people? Temple? Laurel's secret script. The way that our shop is written in Laurel secret script. Also, these are temple people. Are we doing something sus? Hold up. Racist! Racist! Yes, we do. You kill him. Kill him. Nah, don't ask him. Off screen? Off screen? I bet Mio could eat Shiki's disgusting cream pie hot pot. Wait, Eris still hasn't had banana milk yet? Okay, so Lime kicked their asses. I wanted to see it. Ew! Ew! No, no, no. I didn't think it could get worse. I did not think it could get any worse. But bro just keeps fucking making it even worse. Yo, you got fucking all that sour cream. Then you're putting mayonnaise on top of that shit. That's fucking disgusting. What's up? Oh, it's the maid girl again. The actual maid girl. The sister of the librarian girl at, at school. But what's worse? What's a worse experimentation? Shiki's fucking, you know, experimentation with the, the hot soup? The hot pot? Or like, you know, what Bright and, you know, the temple was doing with the humanoid experimentations. I, I, th I think Shiki's fucking hot pot experimentation is morally, ethically wrong on a totally different level. Okay. He's watching dishes? <laughs> oh, that's a funny image. I mean, I don't know why it's funny. Like this... Cool, you know, glasses wearing, smart, you know, fucking, you know, librarian girl at school. It's mysterious. I don't know. She's just doing dishes in the back. <laughs> How many bottles is she in? Sashimi. Yo, let's go to Laurel. They are. Oh god, it's glazed up. Ew, ew, ew. Like, what you could do now to make this even worse, she could, could now just, like, add, like, more butter in there. Maybe fucking, like, margarine. Like, just, just, like, still, like, double down more and more. And Laurel, maybe more Eastern. Sounds like Asia. If they're eating, you know, sashimi, then, you know, maybe it's, like, the Japan equivalent over here. But also, didn't they say, like, this map of our world is based on Japan, right? The world that exists here is, like, basically, like, a superimposition of Japan, right? So watch Laurel also be in the same place. Like, what's, like, the fucking fish market special of Japan? Hokkaido? No, Hokkaido's for uni. Uh... Fucking uh, Osaka? That's like the fishing side, right? I don't fucking know about Japan, but I don't know. Mm -hmm. Oh, these are the two nations right here. Laurel and Linia. Okay, here we go, here we go. Here it is, here it is, here it is. So these people are Limia, and the new people visiting is Laurel. Limia has a princess. Hibiki. Hibiki priestess still here. Oh! Limia! Oh, Hib Hibiki is the uh, isekai uh, girl, right? And the... Okay, so Hibiki is that girl. The priestess. Who is the priestess? The one that cut her hair? I'm, I'm having a hard time putting a face up to her name, but they... Okay, they're, they're, the priestess is part of the Limia party, but she should be part of Laurel. Bring her back. The lolly? Okay. That's kind of fucked up, true. She was actually just kidnapped? Oh, 
Why did the priestess leave? Do we even know? So she went of her own volition. But they're like, no, bring her back no matter what. Are you implying you're gonna kidnap Niko sama then? <laughs> yeah, well, that's what you're implying, right? You're gonna fucking break, you're gonna kidnap her back? Alright. I haven't seen Hibiki in a while though. This seems a little unreasonable. Second attack, Fort Stella. Fort Stella is the same demon place, right? Basically, the first couple episodes of Skimichi Season 2 was the attack onto Fort Stella, right? That we saw that when Rona was there, and same with the Baldi, right? Yes! Fuck the Empire! Fuck that, uh... I forgot his, the guy's name. Tomoe is so drunk. What is, what is going on? This poor girl. This poor fucking girl. <laughs> just like master, just like apprentice? What are you putting in there? Alright, okay, so you got you got cream pie, you got fucking sour cream, then you have mayo, and then you put banana in there. That is disgusting. That you're just making it worse and worse. What the fuck is she eating there? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. What was the meal eating? Was she eating the pot? She's eating the pot as dessert. It's for the texture, bro. It's for the fucking texture. Hey, I think they deserve the fun, though. Spitting bars again. Hi, Q. Who's talking? Root? Oh, Princess Lily? Lily? And that is the end of today's episode of Skimichi, which seems to be mostly politics, right? Mostly set up. So the most important thing that's happening right now is we got like a school festival happening. But during the festival, it's going to be like a, all the different schools are also going to show up to our school. It's going to be like a tournament arc based off of that, right? So our students have been kind of... Our students are trained to a level where I don't think any of the students in our school can compete with, right? They're basically being able to use more multi-elements. They, they're just practically trained. The experience should be overlapping right anyone else but the other schools we don't really know much about them maybe there's some top tier candidates there but it's looking like we're gonna have a really cool arc there's some stuff going on with the temple and i don't know necessarily if they're good or not right usually the temple the church isekai those people are usually bad but we also do know that there are some humans that don't like the goddess right and based on what this red-headed lady with the scar on her face hidden by the veil was saying that makoto could be her trump card I don't know what she's implying. It would be cool if she's implying that, you know, she is not on the goddess's side and there's like an opposition and, you know, we're trying to rally around Makoto, but who knows? Maybe we're fucking cooking with the metal spoon in the microwave and it's not really that case. And that's pretty much it. Other than that, it's been pretty much fun stuff with like more slice of life moments, you know, Banana, Mio and Tomoe coming back in to get a little bit more screen time. And I guess this part, right? The fact that the Hibiki, uh, the other reincarnated girl from our school, has the priestess who's the lolly. And the priestess, Miko-sama, is from Laurel, the different nation. And Laurel is like, yo, you're taking our priestess hostage. But it's like, nah, she went by her own volition. What's going to happen with the conflict here? Maybe they're going to start some shit. A lot of different things are just kind of, you know, being connected. So this is looking like a fun half of season two. But that's it for me. If you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. But until next time, take care.